morning, everybody. My name is Darlene, and I have Parkinson's. Okay, I'm sitting quite still today. My pills are not working right now, but I just took them, so hopefully soon. Let you know the update for today. I had a doctor's appointment this morning. Um, it was the doctor who was looking after the neuropathy, which it sort of explains itself with my hands. They're sort of stuck in a position like this, and my feet are stuck where they don't go up and down. Um, and there's no, no feeling. So therefore holding a pen, stylus, any of that stuff is lots of fun. Touching something with my finger doesn't get recognized sometimes. So I have had a little bit of trouble with doing some of my computer stuff, but I persevere and I will keep, I'm sorry about the light flashing on and off. And I don't know what that, that is right now. I think it's the way I, I'm angled because I'm in a different chair. Anyway, you see Yoshi in the background over here. <laughs> It's really funny. When I'm taping, Yoshi is usually fairly quiet, but she chirps once or twice. When I am playing it back to hear how it went, she goes ballistic. She's a, a chatterbug. She must recognize her own voice, and away she goes. But anyway, today we went to the doctors. The one that was in charge of the neuropathy for me, haven't seen him very often. The last time I saw him, he did a, a electrical test. And he did to compare from a previous electrical test that somebody else had done. And then he um, also sent my DNA down to Washington um, to have them check it at a special clinic to see if anything showed. We have now got the results back from that test and nothing has shown um, in that test. But there's another test that he wants to do and send back to Washington for them. It's some kind of a virus that... Um, affects the neuropathy because he said the neuropathy in my hands and feet is progressing very rapidly which worries him how rapidly it is and I said well I've been trying to say that for a while but anyway um, so he what he's going to do is we're going to do some blood work we did some today we're going to do some blood work on November the 2nd and then on November the 9th we're going to do a spinal tap and um, sometime after that, within a few weeks, we will be doing the bone marrow. So after all of that, I'll be poked and prodded well and thoroughly, and hopefully we have some answers. I'd really like to do something about my hands, because that has really stopped me from doing so much. And I'd really like my pills to work on a consistent basis, because when I'm slowed down like this, it's terribly hard to get anything accomplished at all. And when I'm animated and jumping around, I'm like throwing things and like not meaning to, but dropping everything. So I don't know. It's crazy. So anyway, um, that's kind of where I'm at today. Now let's see. What else can I tell you that's maybe good news? Hmm. Good news. That's harder to come by these days. Um, we're pretty happy where we are. Uh, that, that would make me very happy. Um, we're enjoying where we're, where we're living. We're enjoying having a beautiful yard that we can use for the dog. Um, we are enjoying having the garage so Claudine can have her friends over and they can play cards out in the garage. And, and Bill and I still have our privacy in here. It's lovely to have Ivy and Cole so close by. And Cal and Ashley are like only four or five blocks away and they come over all the time. And we love it. So this is a good thing. Oh, do you hear that crazy noise in the background? That's the uh, washing machine. It sounds like a rocket ship taking off when it hits the spin cycle. So we always know where we are in the cycle when the rocket ship comes. <laughs> anyway, let's see. Um, I haven't been talking for very long and I really don't have a lot more to say. Claudine has taken the dog for a walk right now. Um, we did go out this morning. Bill went out uh, in the taxi up to uh, Marlboro Mall. don't think he got anything. I don't see anything in a, any bag, so I'm assuming he didn't. Um, he did say he bought Subway for supper, which I was a little disappointed about. Normally I love Subway. But Claudine and I had kind of discussed having um, chicken bites, and that really was singing to me. But I guess, or maybe we might have the sub sandwiches for tomorrow and uh, still do the bites tonight. I don't know. It's kind of luxurious eating two nights in a row out. I don't think we really need to do that, so we probably will just do one. Anyway, we'll see what happens. Um, what else? Uh, my neck is still really sore. Um, it's been sore off and on. 
what I really think it is, is Claudine has to unfortunately do a lot of lifting of me. So I end up putting my hands up like this and around her neck and then she lifts up. And I think that sort of pulls into my neck and my shoulder and chest. So, but I dare not complain about this because she, believe me, has had the worst part of that job to try and lift me up and shift me from one side to the other. That's not an easy thing to do and I feel bad that she's doing it. Anyway, um, I guess I'm going to let you all go for now. I'm hoping that, I see, what day of the week is today? Today is Wednesday. So I hope you all have a good Wednesday, and I'll talk to you on Thursday. All right, bye-bye.